Hey everyone, I'm Emily Canham. Thanks for joining us on Icon UK. Today we're going to be recreating the look of my new idol, the gorgeous Daisy Ridley. So Daisy's skin doesn't look particularly dewy, so I'm going to start off with the Max Factor Miracle Match Foundation. And I'm going to apply this with my L'Oreal Sculpt brush, and then I'm going to blend it in with my Beauty Blender. This will just give me the finish that I really want, and it'll look really natural. Next up, I'm going to use my Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer. This is just going to add some light under my eyes, which I feel like Daisy had. She didn't have any crazy highlighting or anything shimmery, but she definitely did have some brightness under her eyes. I'm going to blend this in again with my Beauty Blender, just to make it all match. I'm going to set that with my Soap & Glory One Heck of a Block Powder. This is just going to make sure nothing creases. Next up I'm going to use the Urban Decay Smoky Palette. Firstly I'm going to use the colour Whiskey. So I'm going to pop this in the crease and then of course using a fluffy brush I'm going to blend that out. Moving on to the lid colour, Daisy has a kind of smoky silvery colour which is shimmery so I'm going to grab the colour Armour and pack that onto the lid. I'm also going to grab that silver colour and run that under the eyes. This is definitely what Daisy's done and it's just going to tie off the eye look. I'm then going to go back in with a fluffy brush and blend out all the edges. For mascara, I'm going to use the Max Factor Voluptuous False Lash Effect. I feel like Daisy's lashes are volumized but not necessarily lengthened, so this is the perfect mascara. So Daisy's face is quite bronzed and contoured, so I'm going to grab the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Sculpt Palette along with the brush, and I'm going to grab the contour shade and I'm going to run that on the contours of my cheeks and then blend it out with a different round top brush. Moving on to brows, I'm going to keep it pretty simple because Daisy's brows were, so I'm going to use the Benefit Gimme Brow in the brown shade. I'm just going to run this through my brows and it's going to help with the shape and just to make them a little bit darker. I'm then going to grab my powder and powder the rest of my face. Daisy's face isn't particularly glowy so that's why I'm going to do that. And then her face is quite bronzed so I'm using my NARS Casino Bronzer which is my absolute favourite. And I'm just going to bronze around my face where the sun would naturally hit it. Moving on to lips, I'm going to use the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Matte Max Lip in Disturbia which is 06. It's just a beautiful orange colour which I really feel matches Daisy's look. I'm going to put a gloss over the top because everything was matte besides the lips. So I'm going to use the Bare Minerals Moxie Lip Gloss in Party Starter, which is a really lovely orange colour. And here's the finished look. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, guys. You are now red carpet ready. For more videos from me, click the i button just there. And for more celebrity inspired tutorials, click the link just there. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.